Here in the San Francisco Bay Area, we've built a demonstration network that can deliver up to one gigabit per second throughput by aggregating FDD LTE and CBRS spectrum. CBRS stands for Citizens Broadband Radio Service and is a unique 3.5 gigahertz shared spectrum band. A CBRS network that uses LTE offers very high performance that opens up endless possibilities for new business models and brings increased network capacity. Today, I'm going to show you how the network is delivering 676 megabits per second throughput. This is an industry first for CBRS FDD LTE networking. The network uses four carrier aggregation with 256 QAM running over a Nokia CBRS base station and Qualcomm Snapdragon LTE modem. In addition, a Nokia Bell Labs Spectrum Access System, or SAS, manages the CPRS multi-tier shared spectrum. Currently, we are transmitting over two FDD carriers. The SAS has just indicated that one CBRS carrier is available. This is reflected in an increase in the end-user downlink group. SAS has now indicated the availability of another CBRS carrier. Again, we see an increase in end-user big downlink throughput. Now it is close to 700 megabits. In addition to this high throughput, carrier aggregation of CBRS with the lower FDD band has increased the CBRS coverage area, which translates into a larger high throughput area for end-users. Enterprises and operators can deploy Nokia CBRS networks to provide unique new services without the need for exclusive spectrum. Come and meet us at the Mobile World Conference 2017 in Barcelona to see how we are commercializing and pushing the boundaries of CBRS. We would love to discuss what these exciting developments mean for you.